Stick around if you want to see how I interchange these bottles. So if anybody is like me, you have a particular brand of plugins and if you're ordering stuff online like I do, you ordered the wrong thing. So I ordered these and these do not fit in my Airwick plugin. These ones for Airwick have these little grooves on there that slides up and locks in there. So I have the only way I can get these in there is if I like bootleg it and put them in there and then you risk it falling out and just spilling everywhere. So, got my needle nose pliers. I have successfully gotten this top off of the Airwick one. So, I'm going to try to do the same thing with this like glade one it's probably like an off-brand one too so it's not probably really glade and i'm gonna just with my needle nose try to pull this top off so i can get the oil out easily and it is coming off so that is awesome figure I should capture this moment because I'm probably not the only person who has done this and so directly speaking I guess I would want to change out this read too but I'm not even focus on that right now and now my focus is going to be on getting the oil now into the airwick one bam here we go so if you make that mistake just hold on to a used one and fill it in. Um, so what I want to do now is put this one in here, but I want to take out this old reed or whatever from my Airwick one. And I want to try to put in the reed. And look at that, that worked. I recycle all this stuff, so goes in my recycle bin, makes my recycle bin smell good. <laughs> Nothing else. I'm gonna pop this top back on. So I pop the airwick top back on with the reed from the new one. Throwing away the old reed. Bam. If it doesn't fall out. <laughs> so, I mean, it's simple. You could do it too. Don't be scared if you make that mistake again. Plus, other ones have different scents that the other brand may not have. So, you can do it too. Thanks for watching.